And a welcome back into Dodger Poke Report for this afternoon. We have a very, very, very special guest live from the Bricktown Ballpark, downtown Oklahoma City. Right-handed pitcher in the Dodgers organization, Yency Almonte, joins us. So, Yency, I want to thank you for joining us. Thank you. All right, let's start with a, a good start to this year. Seven innings pitched, seven Ks, just one walk. And whenever you get your strikeouts up and your walks down, you're usually pretty successful. So start about uh, talk about how 2022 has started for you. Probably one of the best starts I've had going into spring training and going into a season. So right now my confidence is really high. I'm working my new pitch match now. No more four teams, more two teams and sinkers. So seeing the success I'm having with it early kind of feels pretty good. 2020 was a huge year for you, especially when you look at your strikeout to walk ratio. That seems to be kind of the formula for you is is to, to lower the amount of walks and then increase the amount of strikeouts. 2022 this year seems to be shaping up like 2020 did. I, I agree. I mean, my, big, my biggest thing is when I'm doing well is when I'm attacking hitters yeah. and not falling behind counts. And I feel like this year so far I've been doing pretty good at just going after hitters and making them think about early. You're from Miami yes. and your second appearance in the major leagues was in Miami. So that had to been cool for you, huh? Yeah, I guess Miami. It's pretty cool just playing that hometown team. You know, those have been doing minor play in front of hometown fans and having my people there, family, friends, everyone there. So. Awesome. A lot of requests? Yeah, a lot. Yeah, yeah, so I bet that was a really cool experience. Now, uh, you, you talked about your, picks, uh, your pitch mix and, and where you're at with it. You had the plus-plus slider, the fastball, so talk about where you're at with your pitches. Right now, I feel really good with my fastball. Being primarily two things, so really good with it. Getting a lot of confidence with it right now early. My biggest takeaway right now is making sure I can throw my slider both times to play. Because right now, I'm trying to go glove side sometimes, and I'm pulling it more than I want to. Yeah. I know that when I have when I need it for a, for a punch out, it's going to be there. You've been with four different organizations, so you know what it looks like somewhere else. Now you're with the Dodgers. I think the Dodgers have the best developmental system in the game. Can you speak to that? I, I agree. I mean, I, I got here second day of spring training. It set me down, went over everything, analytics-wise, stuff that I never heard before, and they pretty much told me some of the game plan. And doing it in games right away, I'm thinking that's what they're doing here right now. Yeah, and obviously you're a guy that pitches with a lot of confidence. Yeah. As your handle on social media would say, Showtime. How'd you come up with that? <laughs> well, I played basketball in high school, too. Okay. And I was messing around at the park, I got my house. I'll go out there and just learn how to dunk. So I start windmilling and doing all this crazy stuff. And every time I went ah, up, ah, they're like, hey, it's Showtime. Ah, ah. And that's what I stuck with it. I got to ask you then, can you still windmill? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I thought they said pitchers aren't athletes, huh? Oh, wrong guy. Wrong guy, wrong guy. <laughs> hey, Yency. Uh, so excited to have you as a Dodger. You've had a wonderful year so far in 2022. Just best of luck. Thank you. I appreciate it.